Welcome back to our channel. Um, hope everyone's well and having a nice time. Uh, this will probably be the last video that we do at Haven. Um, we'll be moving on to Park Dean Sethew. So, uh, what did you think of Haven? Um, the caravan is brilliant. So we have obviously cheapest chips holidays. So this is a two bedroom sofa. So it's the cheapest. And if I'm honest, it's better than the other two bedrooms Haven have done. And then maybe that's because this site is fairly new. Um, the bedroom is bigger. Um, the living room seems uh, bigger. Couple of things, niggly things like no frying pan, which is a pain in the because of the dog has steak. The wife went in Morrison's and got the frying pan. I had to buy one. And she must have looked for the world's smallest frying pan. <laughs> it's just... It fits probably a fried egg. The thing is, our hobbit arm is induction. So I'm going to buy a cheap little pan because it's a throwaway. So I'm not going to buy one because we can't use it at home. So he has to have his steak on holiday. So... He had a four yeah, quid You pan. won't fit a steak on that frying pan, I'm it's, telling you. It's 20 centimetres. He will get a steak in there. So the dog is sorted. He's got a steak. Um, yeah. uh, another so, uh, what? Go on. No, I was just going to say, another, I think I've mentioned it. That that mirror, mirror this window where it's broken, I've actually found the part to that. Have you? Where? Yeah. It's down the back of this cushion. So um, whoever cleans these... Uh, caravans. I think they do a bit of sweeping under because usually with these caravans they're kind of blocked so you, they, yeah. the set goes to the floor but I don't know if you can see this but the there's a gap under the settees under the settees um, and I think the clean and now I'm not um, accusing anyone but yeah. I think she's doing a bit of sweeping rubbish yeah, under the because setting. this this caravan um one thing that i don't like we've got a dog so obviously um you know people who have dogs in these caravans they're gonna smell but you you pay extra to haven to bring a pet so that is for the cleaning now this caravan i could smell a dog smell not as bad as the one in blackpool but the little mat by the door I'm not wiping my feet on it because it's got clumps of dog hair, which they've not hoovered. So I think, like Andy said, they've given it a quick sweep because we paid for early check-in. I think it was about 20 quid or something. And and I think they, like Andy said, have swept it all under the settee. Um, she's a bit nasty. Mm -hmm. So... Yeah, we like clean nice. places, but we like, uh, we like cheap places, but we like... Clean yeah, so I'd get a cupboard door falling off, uh, um, um, just old looking, but I, I can take that, but it's got to be clean. Mm. And, um, and this site, Haven, I think, I believe they've had this site for a year, but this caravan, we, th we expect it to um, have come from another Haven park. Yeah. It's, it's not brand new. These, these vans are definitely not a year old. They have been shipped for months. Other parks, uh, uh, surplus, or probably a haven that's closed down, or a, a, a park that's been. Or they might they might have um, upgraded other caravans at other parks, and Mail, these spares yes, have come out. Juggled them about. I'll definitely come back again, though. Oh, this yeah, has not put yeah, me off. Not, yeah. Um, Carla Gran, that was dirty. I yes. class as dirty, and I didn't like the park there. I, I that mean, was a haven park. The size of the park. It's quite it, huge, it is isn't it? because we I mean I will put some drone pictures up probably about now. We did actually go on our scooters around the site yesterday and um every haven has a a, a restaurant called a mash and barrel. Is it oh now barrel and mash? Yeah. <laughs> it's barrel and mash, I something think. Something like that, yeah. Something like that. They've always got the same names and This is it, the only one we found it has. It's hasn't. not got one. I can't remember the name. We have done footage because yeah. it it was closed. The club was closed, but I did go by the glass door and and, and have a peek in. I mean, it's all situated the same. You've got a Nisa or a Nisa. Uh, or is it a Premier? No, it's a Nisa shop. 
And you've got a laundrette, I think it's next to that. And you've got the sales office. Yeah, you've got the fish and chip shop called Cooks, which is all the same. Yeah. Um, and then you've got the, the little huts that sell sort of sweets and, and hot dogs, you know, during the week. You've got the outdoor camera, uh, outdoor screening, I suppose, is for the more, because we're in early season, so that'll probably be where the warmer weather, the outdoor shows and stuff. Um, mm. You've got the carts where you can hire. The doggy park. Yeah, the little doggy park is better. It's smaller, but it's better than Haven Caster. And the only reason why it's better because the the pickets, the picket fence, the slats are more together. Small dogs like ours can't mm. fit through. Mm. Haven, it's kind of a bit. Of, I reckon our dog can fit his head through. The one at Caster, yeah, but this park, it's it, it's like um, smaller for the dogs, and it's. Got newer, um, oh, what are they like? Exercise ramps yeah, that can obstacles. run up. Obstacles, that's yeah. the word. I can't, I can never think of words off the top and of my head. There's the bungee trampoline. Yeah, I at first, don't ask me why, because it's kids. I thought it was them bungee jumps where adults give with spring in the air. It isn't. They've got four trampolines in there, and it's what the elastic, what they like safety uh, for the kids. Yeah. So they've got four trampolines, which is good. I mean, you went into the arcade. I had a little you? browse about the arcade, yeah. It, it's not the biggest arcade, but it's it's okay. It's got the usual yeah. stuff. I'll tell you what, though. The the shop on site, the Nisa, well, I suppose them all the same, but it's quite pricey. Yeah, and well stocked. But it is, they always are, though, aren't they? Well, they're going to pay extra. If you've just got here yeah, and you want exactly. to get your few odd bits and all that. It's okay for, like, bread, milk. Thing you wouldn't do like a week shopping. Well, though it? saying that, Tesco's for us we can't walk it. Yeah, but it's, Tesco's it's it is a like ten minute walk, literally. It, probably at the most yet for us in the car, it is a minute easier. So you come out of here, go down to the main end, the main entrance because it's like a one road that leads here. Turn left and then left again. Yeah. And you're at in fact, you actually pass it to come on site. So, yeah. um, also on the video we did yesterday, we didn't realise till we viewed it, there's a train station there, or we've seen a train going past. Yeah. On that footage. Train track. Yeah. I mean, the site's quite huge, is it? Have you mentioned it is that? No, we haven't. Now, Andy, the thing is, when you do drone, you know, footage, you're looking at it, and it's you can't. Believe, there's that many caravans here. It, it is, it I is never a massive it, site. Yeah, I didn't think it was that big, but you'll see. Are you doing that on a separate... Um, no, I'll probably do it on this. Show bits, yeah. Oh, so yeah. you'll probably see it somewhere along this video then, but I'm trying to think what else there is. Um, That's think, about it. I mean, it's uh, it's been raining a lot, as it is all over the country. We've had such a... Um, a wet winter. A wet winter. <laughs> We've had loads of rain, basically. Yeah, we've had loads of rain. But, so everywhere's boggy. Yeah. It's very uh, muddy out there uh, and sloshy. And it says not to park in the grass because yes. they've had to get a tractor out to a few cars who've got stuck. Luckily, we've got parking by the caravan anyway. So, yes. so the, the, the van was covered in mud from Wales. It's now covered also with mud from the Yeah, but we're tidy people so we respect the caravan even though they didn't clean it that good well it's okay so when we come in the caravan we took our shoes off and uh at the door so we didn't traipse it through yeah when i said the van i meant our van not this van our driving van oh <laughs> well, you see, well the... this van wouldn't be covered in mud from oh, wales oh. would it oh our van i mean we're going on to park d and we need to get the can i just pause it for a sec the dog's really annoyed you, that we tidied up these toys. You, look, so he's fetching them all. He's getting them out one by one the from the is, bin. I, I know these caravans are small and, you, you know, I've, you can never keep them tidy. And so when Andy takes a dog around the park um, on his scooter, I've put all his toys in the bin because they're scattered everywhere. And he's got a... Turn him around, look, look. Turn I mean, him around. He doesn't it. even play with it. He's he, got a little he quilt. Just, he just... As long as they're out. Yeah, he. But he's, he's got a little quilt out, so he's comfy, and he's got his. He's got two of my um jackets, fleecy things on there that he's been lying on. 
Nothing to say. That's for him. Um, your your coat over there, your zip yeah, up. Yeah, my zip up coat, really. He's been lying on that. So. Yes. We are thinking about um, June. Uh, we've got nothing planned in June at the moment, have we? And no. though we're going to the cottages for my birthday treat, I might have to look for a sneaky, cheapest chips treat. And I'm thinking Haven in Mablethorpe, which is not far from here. So we might have a drive down there just to see where it is because I think June, before the kids break up, June and early July, they're still cheap. And maybe we'll do a Monday to Friday in one of that. It, compare the parks. Mm -hmm. So, but yes, I do like it here. I definitely would come back um, again, wouldn't we? Yeah, yeah. He's being quiet now, which is a sign he's telling me to shut up. Oh, no, no, you carry on, my little flower. <laughs> Please don't uh, call me flower off camera. <laughs> this is, uh, yeah. Yeah, I like this. I do like it. I, I mean, I was when we first pulled up to the caravan because you can tell the two bedrooms and the not very big caravan, the small. And when we pulled up, I thought they give us a three bedroom because it does look longer than the normal two bedroom. I have seen smaller caravans on site though. So, um, the thing is, is that we take too much stuff every time we go we say we're going to take less stuff less stuff and we never do i've just had to clear out the van it's all full of stuff you would think uh we've got all our stuff here i mean there's it's what i call my stuff which is all the cables electrics gadgets they all go in that rucksack there uh we've got food which hopefully will be eaten before All the keys go. and whatever's above the fridge over there. Lisa's got her coals. Uh, she's quite good. She's uh, restricted herself to one small suitcase, like hand luggage yeah, suitcase. Moving. I've got and a, a small a small case, a small bag, and we usually I've got a wet bag, uh, so I can because we kind of feel if we run out of clothes, we just uh, use the laundry. Yeah, bag. because the thing is. Um, we we have got big but, cases, the large cases, but last time, well, yeah. I say last time, the last time he used it about a year ago, he had a funny turn uh, when we was in Great Yarmouth and we had to have ambulance out. It was carrying my, <laughs> carry my bloody case, my huge case. So we've cut down and we just think, you can get these um, laundrettes at, um, I can't think of the name, but they're based at um, petrol stations. You can wash and dry. So, There's a laundrette here. Well, there is, but with that one on a car park, sometimes when we're checking at one place, there's about three hours before we're checking somewhere else. So we're going to wash and dry. You know, I'll take my, we take our arm bath towels, tea towels. I'll take my arm pillar. Um, she does. I mean... We didn't take the air fryer last time, and we did miss it. We've got we the, have got the air fryer, which is, which is, which is over the back, just here. That um, air fryer, though, that is our air fryer we brought, and we have done a video on that actually, Scarville. Uh, we did a video, and it's amazing. About it's, six uh, months ago, it was very cheap. I think we had it from our start around thirty, thirty-five pound. Um, so that's probably about six months ago, I think I did a video. That is our, for when we do get out of our tram, that will be the one what we're going to uh, keep in there, isn't it? So. so this is a summary of uh, uh, Haven Park Dean. By the way. Haven um, Park Dean? No, Haven. <laughs> Haven Skegness. If you watched the last video, the thumbnail, I spelt Haven wrong. I spelt it with an R. I always do it. Uh, it's H A V E N. I there spell has it been H A V E R N. No, yeah. there's been yeah. times where he's made mistakes in the past. Stupid spelling mistakes in my font. So the last video, which will probably be shown at the end of this, as a thumbnail here or there, um, it's spelt wrong. Before you comment, 
uh, and talking about comments please leave a comment even if it's to say great video bad video um, uh, like my hairdo or anything or if it deserves a belt around the chops um, we love comments we try and answer all comments uh, I do not need a belt around the chops you do I don't uh, so we're going to end this here yeah we're going to wife's going to make me another cup of tea we I have I've probably mentioned this before no I've... I'm not going to make it I've got my coffee here yeah? I mean, as, um, as long as you're alright no we have I was on the maps because I was looking at where we're staying and what's around um, I've probably already said this but from not far from here in fact I have said this before there's a Miami beach that I want to we want to go and have a check out. We're popping off there. We're yes. going to go and drive there in a minute and just browse. But I mean, we will be doing uh, in in the future, probably next week. We will be doing tours of Skegness at the moment. Now the weather's a bit dodgy, so we're probably doing like a drive through or uh, on our scooters uh, of Skegness. I think some of the places, some of the, some of the shops are closed though because we're still early yeah. season. So uh, um, maybe it'd be good coming back. Definitely June to make yeah. thought. Well, I think we can do Skegness at least, uh, and then do other, the other towns, Maplethorpe, Sutton. Yeah, I'm as saying well. in June, um, maybe we should book um, for Maplethorpe. Mm -hmm. That's not too far away. We can compare to this park. Yes. So I definitely like this park. I hope this helps anyone who wants to come to Skegness yeah. Haven. Uh, I think I if you've got families, it. if you've got young kids, it's definitely an ideal park. You're not that far from Skegness Town where you've got other things to do. Pardon me, but this park is definitely good. The one we did in Wales, I'd probably say it was not... I wouldn't probably want to go there with young kids, so that's my opinion, though. But this park, I definitely would bring young kids, so that's it, really. See you in the next one. He's going to have to edit this because this has been waffling on. I'll see you in the next one. Uh, and you lot stay safe.